Okay, let's take some data. I've got the frequency set to 1.295 hertz, uh, kilohertz, sorry. The voltage across the inductor is 1.7 volts. The voltage across the capacitor is 6.4 volts. You can see they don't match. As I go up in frequency, I can raise the voltage on V sub L and the voltage on the capacitor will start dropping. There's a reading. There's a reading. There's a reading. Capacitor not dropping much. It is starting to drop on the capacitor. Five point zero and five point nine at two point one nine nine kilohertz. Five point two and five point seven. We're getting close. When they're exactly equal, that's the sign of resonance. But it's hard for me to find it just by turning the knob. So we're close, and I'll try and get more. Uh, change it a little more. 5.5 and 5.5. So that's close to the resonance, but they not, that may not be exactly it. This one goes up, that one goes down. That one keeps going up. Capacitance keeps going down. You're writing this down in your notebook, I presume. There's another one. And you'll be want to fit two straight lines to the data near the crossing point and then see where those straight lines cross. We're almost back to where the voltages were, but in the opposite direction. You can even pause the video if you really need to, to get the reading. Well, we really only need to be close to the resonance, so I think that'll do.